You guys must really hate me. That's all right. That's okay. You don't have to say anything. I can tell just from these suggestions, but I think you might have messed up because in our last video, our top comment was from Bomb24Beat saying that we should do the Joker, but we can only melee with it. So that's what we'll be doing today. And if you got a weapon suggestion and a challenge, go ahead and leave that down in the comments below. I'll have a comment there as well with all the weapons that we've already completed. So make sure you check that out before commenting so we don't get any repeats. But the reason why I think you guys messed up is because not only is Shipment 24-7 back, which thank God this playlist should be in the game regardless, but... I think I was going to melee with it anyways. But we already went ahead and got this leveled up on stream. Shout out to those of you that come by the stream. And for our camo challenges, we need to get 40 kills with it, which is, you know, big whoop, 40 kills. Not too bad. And then to get gold, we need to get two kills without dying 10 times. And I think that would be pretty easy to get done. The launchers are kind of a joke in this game. And I have a nice little build for it with the red solid color camo, the nice big koi fish in the little crane. Looks pretty cool. And really quick, that's the class we'll be using today. Of course, we have the Joker in here and we have the double smoke with our double tactical perk. Some techs on here, not going to be using very much, but we have double time, double tactical, resupply, and quick fix, as well as dead silence. So let's go ahead, hop in, and try to get these camos done. Now for this challenge, honestly, I think probably trying to shoot the Joker here on shipment is going to lead to more deaths than, you know, not going for it. So I probably would have just meleeed anyways, but I've been seeing you guys out for blood in those suggestions. Basically, what the, the most common suggestion boils down to is use, you know, insert weapon here, but you can't play the game is, is what I've been seeing because I've been seeing a whole lot of the no sprinting since I brought it up. And on top of that, people are adding in their own little flair of just some random BS that would just make the camo so hard to do. But you know what? Bring it on. Bring on everything. We'll try it. And the launchers aren't as scary as they were in previous games. Like in this, literally just getting 40 kills with it and then two kills without dying. That is nothing compared to launchers in previous games. Because right now we're on a tear. I think we just got like four kills without dying right there. And shipment only makes it easier. But I will say my KD has been absolutely awful getting this thing leveled up. There are games where I had like probably less than 15 kills and 60 deaths. So it's not like I'm not out here getting my, my ass beat. But as long as we're still getting progress and we're still moving forward, I count that as a W. Come here. There you go. Eat that. Ooh, there we go. That's another one. That's a teammate. But it seems like a lot of these guys are pretty clueless, especially this guy. He had no idea we were even there the whole time. Come here. There we go. Oh, a quick double. Don't mind if I do. And I can kind of just hang out over here while I wait for my prey to enter the smoke. Oh, there we go. Night, night. Lay, lay. This is so much fun. But quick little PSA for you guys. Uh... I started streaming on Twitch again. It's been a minute, but we streamed uh, twice this week playing Resident Evil, and I've been having such a fun time playing through that game. I haven't really played a Resident Evil. Uh, I played seven. I don't remember if I beat it or not, but I, I like watch people play through it. I watched some playthroughs at eight. I don't think I ever finished watching through that. But four has just been so much fun. We've been running through it on hardcore. And there, there are parts where it gets frustrating and sometimes I get a little scared. But it's a great game and I, I love mixing it up a bit. And I think I mentioned this before, but I'm going to be streaming more non-COD games over there on Twitch. Uh, I still haven't finished Elden Ring. So I'll probably do a few streams over there of me playing that. And then the DLC for that's going to be coming out, I don't know, sometime in the future. Could be a year from now. Could be next week. We, we, we never know. But if you're looking to watch me play some other games outside of COD, hop on over there. Because honestly, after playing games like Elden Ring and playing some Resident Evil, I feel like my patience is insane. And I can get like whatever weapon done in this game. Like with minimal issues. Like hopping into shipment and dying 80 times a game feels like nothing compared to Elden Ring. Like I've evolved as a gamer to be not phased by dying and unless I'm going for multiple kills without dying. That'll get mad. But today's playlist update was actually kind of a big W in terms of like things that they added. Not a big W that they even have to add it back. I personally think that everything added in today should just be standard and in the game at all times and they should just add in new ones on top of it. But we finally got 10v10s back. We got the party mode playlist back of all the party modes like gun game one in the chamber all that and we got shipment hardcore and core 24 7 like i don't understand where they get off taking it out of the game all the time considering that's like the main thing people want to play if you're trying to like grind camos or just mindlessly like get a bunch of kills but it should just be a staple in this game they don't need to be taking it out and i feel like i, I speak for most if not all people when it comes to the playlists but i know there are some shipment haters out there that'd be like oh shipment ruined cod uh, people only want to play shipment now. No one wants to play any other maps, which is fair because there are no other maps in this game outside of shipment, shoot house, you know, Mercado, farm 18. Like there's probably about four playable maps. The rest, it's like, it's kind of a chore to play on. Maybe I, I left out one or two, but, but I feel like that argument's a little tired because obviously people would want to play on more different maps if they're more efficient or smaller or flowed better. 
but they can only really get shipment and shoot house right for some reason. We're actually flying through this camo challenge. I was expecting to take like a few different games of going for kills to get our first camo here. But we're already at 28 kills. All of them are melees with the Joker. We have how much time left in the game? We might be able to get it all done. Come here. There we go. 10 away. 10 kills away. Even if I only get like a kill per every other life, I'm like a cockroach. I keep coming back for more. Okay, that guy kind of got the best of me there. He was mid reload and just beat my ass into the ground. But the unfortunate thing about not being able to shoot rockets out of this thing is that on the rare chance that you get off a rocket, you'll get a multi-kill most of the time Then it lands. Sometimes you'll end up, you know, spawn killing yourself because you'll shoot it, die, and then end up spawning where you shot the rocket to, which is always hilarious. But if you can actually get a good rocket off and it hits their spawn, you're getting like three to four kills, almost minimum. But I feel like the amount of times you die while trying to get a shot off kind of outweighs it in terms of like the efficiency of the speed you can get the camo done at. Because if you just run around meleeing, you got a way better chance of getting the kills. There was a glitch for a while though at the beginning of the game where if like you drop it and pick it up after you lock onto something, at least that's how I think the glitch worked, you could just instantly Instantly shoot the joker at wherever like it was a kind of cool way of getting it done but they don't got that anymore and it's not like we can shoot anyways but we're only five kills away from us can we get this done in like two games it's crazy the difference in difficulty that the rocket launchers have gotten in between games before it was like take down 40 aerial kill streaks now take down 40 ground kill streaks where there's only two of ground kill streaks in the entire game that nobody uses and it's like get this many kills without dying uh take down just score streaks in general and then there's like attacker and defender medals too in modern warfare 2019 and now it's literally just you can play two games of shipment and have your normal camo and your gold camo done i literally just need one more kill here come here don't you end this game with me needing one more kill oh come on camo curse is setting in now that i'm talking about how easy it is oh you gotta be kidding me damn did i just spit everywhere too had me squirting. Yeah, 39 kills out of 40 is very unfortunate, but one kill is not too hard to get. Okay, we're getting thrown in a match of kill confirmed midway through. So this game's going to last about 30 seconds. So there goes our, our chances of getting this done in two games. But that's our 40th kill. We now have our, our first camo challenge done. Now we just need to get two kills without dying. And I hope they don't turn up the heat on these lobbies. That's one kill. Oh, that would be two if I had any idea what thumbs were and how to use them. Oh, come on. Oh, this guy doesn't see me. That guy did, though. To be honest, using the Joker, kind of easier than the Riot Shield. The Riot Shield gets to block bullets and all, but the Joker, you get a faster kill with just two shots in the melee instead of the three with the Riot. Oh, that was almost a double right there. Come here. Night, night. Oh, somebody just walked by. There he is. No! This guy, though. This guy for sure. Oh, never mind. There's a nade just laying there on the ground. Come here. Sit down. Oh, there's two. Actually, we might be able to get this done and just kill confirmed. That'd be wild. Oh, wait. Never mind. There's like literally two tags away from the game ending. But if I can get a kill before the game ends, it'll carry over into the next game. Oh, never mind. So there we go. We got that camo done. Not going to put it on because it looks better with the solid color. And we actually got two, two kills without dying that game. Not bad. Let's keep this gravy train rolling. Like, come on. Tell me this isn't a cool build for it. I've been really liking the red solid color camo recently. It looks good with a lot of the the stickers that came in the battle pass. Okay. Now we're going against a dude with a knife. That is the kryptonite of somebody meleeing with a launcher. That'll always beat me. Oh, wait. Nope, it will. Bubbler's having the game of his life right now. He already has seven kills within the first, like, two seconds of this game. Come here. There we go. Now, if one of your buddies wants to come up and give me a free kill, I'd be fine with that. Come here. There we go. Ooh, barely got that. I got more people coming. I'm just gonna lay down right here. Nobody look at me. Nobody see me. He sees me. Oh, I still got it, though. I guess the guy with the knife. That was beautiful. He had a double kill. Hold on. Let me get one more kill here. Let's keep the streak alive. Oh, let's go. I somehow hit through his riot shield. Now, I was struggling to get the riot shield done last time. Now, other people can deal with its BS. Oh, wait. Even more people. A bloodthirsty? A six times? We might just be one, two kills without dying away. But don't ever ask me about math. Because I will not know. Okay, we got stabbed. Whatever. Streak's over. Real good progress on it, though. Oh, is that it? Go ahead. Show me. Don't be shy. If not, this is it right here. As long as this guy doesn't die. Bars. Fuck. Come here. No. Okay, now I think we're one away. Night, night. Never mind. Got stolen. Night, night to this guy. And I get stabbed. Fuck off. You don't see me. Lele. 
Oh, there we go. That should be it right there, baby. If not, add another one. What? How? Okay. You know what? I'll get more. I'll get way more. Maybe I'll get more than I need. Now that's gotta be it. There's no way. Is it two kills without dying or is it double kills? Because I feel like we got a decent amount of both. There's gotta be two kills without dying, right? This is where I start to doubt myself. There's the camo curse and there's the camo dementia where I forget what challenge I'm working on. Okay, now I'm thinking that maybe the, the camo challenge like pop up showed up while we were dead. Oh, there it is. Never mind. Let's fucking go. We already got it gold. That was so easy. Get me out of here. And that took a record amount of time, 26 minutes. So after getting it fully leveled, that's all it took to get the Joker done. You, if you would have told me that a year ago, I would have laughed in your face. All right, well, let's hop in game and see what it looks like there. All right, this is what the Joker looks like with gold in game. Honestly, the Joker is one of the best weapons to get camos on because it's basically like holding a giant camo texture. You can really see every part of it, but the camo challenges are super easy for it. Honestly, going for long shots is harder. Taking a preschool math test is harder. My... You know what? I'll leave that one up to your imagination of what I was going to say. But there you have it. Another challenge knocked out and in record time. So maybe give me a little bit of harder challenge next time, huh? Give me give me something difficult to do. But also be gentle because I, I'm talking big game right now, but I'll be scared and sad to do it later. But that's the video. Uh, go ahead and leave your suggestions and your challenges down below. Uh, top comment of the video will be the one that we do next. And uh, thank you guys for all your love and support. I uh, appreciate you guys watching and I will see you in the next one later. Why did I salute? Why did I do that?